how light works with the sculpture is so important. I needed a high degree of thinness to the marble in her hair for translucency. And so a lot of careful carving ensued. An inverted rose is the model for her crown of hair, while the rest references Medusa's snakes, braids, and dreadlocks. Finally, it was time to separate her hair from her neck. Drilling holes in sculpture for hair and other details is an ancient technique that uses a two-person drill. I used a combination of point chisel, a die grinder, and a dremel to drill holes. always switching from the front of her neck to the side of her neck so that the holes met in the center. After an hour, a hole appeared and I kept expanding it, exposed the shoulder and finished the curves of her hair. More work in the sun to thin the rose. And all that's left is light. 